All right, I don't know if this is a video that anybody will ever even need, but just in case, here is how that you can put a graphics card into an Optiplex 30, into an Optiplex 3050. You'll see it's very simple. Sorry for the voiceover. I recorded this at work. I don't know what happened to the audio, but there was no audio. I blame my phone. It wasn't me. I don't have an external mic or anything. Either way, here's the video. This is how you change it. And I did a nice little voiceover for you as well so that you have all the good details. So I wanted to start off with a few shots of the computer. Uh, this is to make sure that you have the same Optiplex 3050 as I was using. Uh, you see the sticker there was Windows 10 Pro. I actually had Windows 7 installed on this computer. Um, as you can see, I do not have uh, any VGA, just a display port and HDMI. So, first off, on the back of the computer you will find two screws. You can use a regular Phillips head screwdriver to unscrew both of the screws. They do not remove because they have the springs so that you cannot lose them. So once they are unscrewed, you just pop the back off like so. And now you are into the computer. There's your power supply. Right there is your heat sink and your processor. And underneath the hard drive actually is where your memory is, which pops out with just the press of one little button there on the blue plastic. This is a device that I was installing, an NVIDIA GT610. Now here I was a moron and uh, undid the VGA portion of this graphics card, but I did not need to, uh, so you can skip that portion of the video. <laughs> All you actually have to do is undo the two screws that are uh, around the DVI port. Those screws are what actually hold on the mount uh, for the graphics card. All graphics cards are normally the same. Some held on by VGA, some held on by DVI. Once the screws are removed, the mount pops off. You grab the correct mount out of the box that you need, which I needed the DVI and HDMI mount. Place the mount over, take your two screws for the DVI, screw them back in to the graphics card. And once it is tightly secured, which do not do it too tight or you could crack the card, you now have your graphics card ready to go in low profile mode, I guess you could say. On this device, you just pull up right here on the outside of the box, super simple. Pop that right out, again, super simple. And you take your graphics card, and just slide it right into the slot. Of course, if you have a different type of graphics card, you would use the slot above it, but that would have to be a pretty old school graphics card. It's more for network cards and devices like that. Now it is installed. Flip your little latch back over and reconnect the computer. Plug in your DVI, HDMI, power, network cable, mouse, keyboard, etc., and power on the computer. Always make sure you plug your monitor cable into the graphics card and not the onboard because the computer will instantly recognize the graphics card and make that the priority. Take your included disc, pop it in the CD tray. And then just auto run the software and select install drivers. It'll install all the drivers that you need. You'll restart your computer. And right after that, as I just said, that's it. There we go. My phone was not letting me record for a minute. All right, that is the video on how to install a graphics card on a new Optiplex 3050. Hope that it was able to help you out. Like I said, the memory is actually right there underneath the hard drive. The hard drive, you just undo the two cables for the hard drive. You're able to just pull a little blue plastic thingy and the hard drive comes right out. Underneath that, some memory and the CD drive if it needed to be replaced. Hope this helps someone out. That's why I created it. Um, hopefully tomorrow we'll return to a regular vlog. Hit the like button and subscribe if this helped you out. If it didn't, hit the dislike button. Either way, leave me some comments. I'm here to hear it all. So, like and subscribe if you can, please. And I will see you tomorrow. Deuces.